Hello viewers, welcome back. Tally has recently uploaded the latest release, Tally Prime release 6.1. So in this video, I will cover the highlights of the release 6.1. And in the subsequent video, I will cover each of the feature in detail, how you can leverage these features using your Tally Prime latest release 6.1. So let me now quickly walk you all through the highlights of release 6.1. Couple of days back, Tally had released latest Tally Prime 6.1. Let us now explore features and enhancements provided in release 6.1. The major enhancement again in this release pertains to GST. The first major feature is invoice management system which is ims tally prime 6.1 launches the gst feature of invoice management system this will simplify itc tracking with features like consolidated invoice view action status update ims itc summary and the option for gst to be recomputation. This feature offers complete control of your ITC with intuitive report and action based processes. Now you can reconcile invoice, set statuses and file return with confidence without any additional step all within your regular accounting flow. You can now view supplier invoice as per the GST portal in a comprehensive IMS Inward Supplies report provided in Tally. Now you can identify the matched, mismatched and missing invoices. Action status to mark invoices as accepted, rejected, pending or no action based on reconciliation can be done now within Tally Prime itself. The next consolidated view of ITC summary is available for pending and rejected ITC. With IMS action, you can click to recompute like just I mentioned, you can recompute your GSTR 2B by ensuring your GSTR 3B filing is accurate and up to date. You can view invoices rejected in IMS invert suppliers in a separate section in GSTR 2B. These transactions are excluded from ITC and written filing, which you can review at any point in time. You have configuration to enable automatic reconciliation for IMS. This will automatically mark the reconciled voucher as accepted where you don't have to manually go and mark the status as accepted in IMS invert supplies. The next feature is edit log summary for tally prime edit log version of tally application. From this release edit log summary will provide complete detail of changes in your vouchers and masters. You can now track the numbers and versions for altered, non-altered and deleted vouchers and masters. There is an independent edit log summary which will provide ease of navigation where you will have overall summary with drill down to individual vouchers and masters to view changes across versions. Additionally, filter option is also provided by activity type that is you can filter by version period or users this will help the viewer to view all or only altered data once security is enabled you can see the users who have made changes to the vouchers and masters the next announcement is enhanced msme experience where in this release tally is provided revised MSME form is now supported with supplier wise summary. You can view pan details of your MSME parties 
along with the paid and outstanding bills within or after 45 days a ease of configuration is provided to view summaries of multiple suppliers you can apply filter and tailor the report to meet both your internal audit and compliance now you can seamlessly export and upload the data directly into excel template and easily upload the file on the mca portal let us see other enhancements in this release there are couple of enhancements as far as the banking features are concerned number 1 convenient split facility now when you split the company all the unreconciled transactions in the split company will now appear as opening brs so that it becomes easy for you to conduct reconciliation next enhanced experience in bank reconciliation couple of more enhancements have been provided that is potential match configuration is introduced in the find match and modify match screens next in the reconciliation report you can now view the bank date even for the book transactions reconciled via linking the third one is payment reverse file now you can import the payment reverse file which is provided by the bank on bulk payment from anywhere in tally prime the import summary is enhanced to display a detail breakup based on payment status other enhancements related to gst easier reconciliation now you can reconcile gst transactions even if there is a difference in the taxable amount between your book and the portal data next enhanced gstr1 filing now you can upload gstr1 data offline using ms excel and csv files this provides greater flexibility and convenience for offline filing broadly these are the major features and minor enhancements that have been provided in release 6.1 from the next video onwards i will take each of this enhancements and we will see how are we going to leverage this enhancements by using tally 6.1 release and also we will learn what kind of configuration is required for you to easily access this report and take benefit of this features i hope this release will immensely help you in managing you are input credit through the ims system that tally provides secondly the edit log summary that tally is provided will now quickly assist you in checking the modifications or deletions done in the organization and of course the msme latest release or the form that is made available will also be useful to all of you so thank you all once again for staying till the end see you all in the next session thank you very much